Okay, so yesterday I had a meet. It was in San Antonio. It was at the Alamo. It was hosted by Aerial Athletics. Vault, I got a 9575. Then on Beam, I got a 9-6. We received the message that my, my husband's grandchildren were in foster care. Simone's mother at that time was having difficulty. So we brought the four children to stay with us. I mean, that decision was a no-brainer. They've been my parents since I was three, and that's all I've ever known. Simone was very hyper. We had like a four-foot mailbox outside, and I would climb up on it, and I would do um, backflips off of it. You don't have it all the way down. It is all the way down. Do you left leg? Always flipping in the living room, on the furniture. I thought that putting her in gymnastics was really something that would perhaps tire her out. Five years ago, I missed national team by one placement. I was just throwing my body and I didn't really care. Oh my God. She had bad form. She was doing things the way she had taught herself. So she had to relearn the skills. So then we went back into the gym and we had a plan. Practice, practice, and more practice. What I saw was special. Ever since then, I've been on a national team. A walk in the park. She's going to Rio. The young woman who's been widely called the greatest of all time. This girl is off the charts. I mean, she's about to step into history. Here we go. Third pass. Two twists, two flips. The most decorated American gymnast of all time. Oh my God, it was incredible that she was actually living her dream. Whenever I finally stood up on the podium for the first time, we look at the flag and the national anthem is playing, we realized all of our hard work had paid off. It was just so exciting. My parents have always been my number one support system because they've always believed in me. They are probably the world's greatest parents. <laughs> Simone, congratulations from the bottom of my heart. We love you.